Okay, so here we are at Pulsar Signs and we're getting ready to wrap this Volvo into a property guy's car. So when we start, we have a, an image of the car in Illustrator and we add the vinyl on top of that. So if we so when we start, we have an image of the car and now we have a completed image which would be sent to the customer as a proof to get the product approved before the final print. Now to get to this stage, we, we come up with a lot of different strips of vinyl that have to be printed on a very high-end printer. And that would look sort of like this, where we have all of the, the strips and all of the different pieces. They are then cut to fit the, the actual shape of the car, and we end up with our final proof that we saw on the other page. Now, at, at this stage, what we have to do, once we've got everything designed, we have to take and, and put all of the pieces together that need to be printed on the printer, which is printed on a, a 3M vinyl typically or some other products that are comparable. Um, now these, this image shows all of the individual prints on the side. So all of those things have to be printed. We can go through some of those now. This is a, an image that will go on the side of the car and the, the very bottom part is just a bit of an extra strip. Then we go to the next one, and there's the other side of the car, and the next piece. There's the uh, part of the top and the hood of the car. There's the other part of the hood, the top of the car. These are the window perfs. So, through the windows, you have to be able to see out from the inside, and uh, but from the outside, there are images that are showing. So these images, you'll be able to see from the outside of the car, but from the inside of the car, it'll just look like tinted glass. It'll be very nice. And that's it. We'll move on to the print. So this is a picture of the Property Guys vinyl being printed on a uh, Mimaki CJV 3160, very high-end printer, produces a beautiful image, and if we zoom in close, we'll see the resolution on the end edges of the letters is very, very crisp. It's very nice. The colors are true. The customer in this case specified the Pantone colors, so we have exact colors for the Property Guys logo. And in a little while, we'll see these images on the Volvo. This is the perforated window vinyl that will go on both on the windows on both sides of the car. This vinyl uh, looks like a photo on the outside and from the inside it just looks like there's tinted glass. Now here we have all of the graphics for the Property Guys car and um, the, t the front two, the, one on the, the short one on the bottom and the tall one on the left in the front, that's all green, are the window graphics. So that's the window perforated vinyl. And the back four for the sides, hood, and, um, and the rest of the car. So um, soon it'll be laminated. It has to sit for a while, then it'll be laminated, and then it'll go in the car. So the night before a wrap, the car is washed in a car wash. But to make sure everything is uh, perfectly clean, we detail the car in advance of the, the wrap here as well. At this point, the vinyl is going through the laminator, which will put a protective plastic coating on the vinyl. At this point, the first piece of vinyl is being put on the side of the car. And it's put on roughly at first, gets taped down, and uh, gradually ap applied to the side. At this point, the backing is off of most of the vinyl. And it's stuck to the car in the front, but not permanently. So we're going to adjust as we go along.
I'm trimming around the door handle and uh, basically we need to pull all of the decal off of everything that's going to be moving or that might trap the handle from coming up. So we want to make sure all the graphic is off of the rubber. So I'm just kind of trimming around the edge between the paint and the rubber, between the gasket and the handle. First side of the car is done on this side. Right. Still missing the so windows. Right here. Yeah. Okay. So thank you so much. Yeah, and the second yeah. side All is right. just coming in. <laughs> the top is now on the car, cut all around the sunroof, and some of the detail work is being done around the door and the windows. Once this is done, we'll be able to put the um, Window perf on. Now the window perf is being installed on the passenger side. It's a big block and we'll cut it out to fit exactly. So both sides of the car are done now including the window perf. And now we're putting on the vinyl on the front hood of the car. And now the last part of the car, major part of the car is going on, which is the back of the car. Then we'll put the window perf in the back. And then there's just some finishing touches. back of the car is now fully installed, license plate is replaced, and the back window will be going on soon. Now the uh, whole car is wrapped, the last piece of vinyl is going on the back window. It's important that this be 50-50 perf for visibility so you can see well through the back window from the driver.